Hey guys, welcome back to the Pop Culture Cafe. I am Huck, and on today's episode, we're going to customize yet another Mego. We're going to take this Admiral James T. Kirk and turn him into this TJ Hooker. So stay tuned. <laughs> All right, gang, let's get cracking, shall we? Now, first of all, you may have seen a previous video I did where I took a bunch of extra Kirks and Spocks and used their uniforms to transform the rest of the original Enterprise crew into the movie attire from Star Trek The Wrath of Khan. So, obviously, I got a, a surplus of William Shatner's laying around and Leonard Nimoy's, uh, but today we're going to deal with William Shatner. So we're going to turn this uh, Kirk Shatner into TJ Hooker. So uh, first things first, you know, we just got to get the uniform off and then we'll start popping on uh, the cop uniform. So let's get going. Here we go. One, two, three. Oh, wow. <laughs> there he is. All right. All naked. Ready to go. Now look, check out down here. Here is the uh, the accoutrement that I'm going to be using today. So there's two different shirts to choose from. There's the all black and then the blue. Now the blue came with it. That's why it all it's all decked out and looks like a cop shirt. And then the black one though, see on TJ Hooker they wore all black cop outfits. So that was a disadvantage when I was trying to do this because they don't make like the, the cop shirt just like that. So I bought the black shirt to try that first to see how that looks with the outfit and then we'll go from there. All right. So let's, uh, all right, let's just get the black costume on right now. Ready? Three, two, one. All right. So here's the black attire and there's one major problem. I don't know if you can tell, but if you look close enough, the shirt is jet black. The pants are dark navy. So it's not an all black attire, right? So it wasn't quite what I, you know, when I looked at the photos online at the outfit, I thought this was going to be black pants and the blue shirt. So this, this would have worked out better, but now it just looks like a, I don't know, a cool black shirt, maybe for another figure. So, all right. So I don't think this works for me personally because it's not the same color. So I'm going to go ahead and, uh, pop him into the dress blues. You know, you can justify it. You know, it's a Mego figure, y'all. You can do anything. So, uh, you know, TJ Hooker can have a dress blue. Maybe, maybe he's visiting somewhere and he needs to wear a dress. It don't matter. He's going to wear blue in three, two, one. Ho! All right, check it out, y'all. That's it. The full attire. TJ Hooker in his cop uniform looking pretty fresh. Look, you, we all know William Shatner. He's got to look fly, man. Right? He's always got his hair done perfect, just like that right there. And his uh, shirt's all tucked in, collar popped down, tie on. He's ready to go. And whoops some ass, too, because look, he's got his billy club right there. Uh, it can't, I bought a, a tube. So I went ahead and just took some black thread and created this holster for this one here. That way, when this isn't in his hand, like, oh, 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 like that, he's just, he's all good. He's all ready to go, man. That's, that's the official look right there of TJ Hooker, man. He's always got this billy club ready. And look, check this, check this belt out. I don't know if you got a good look at this, but it's got like a cool gun on the side. It's got the pepper spray, some extra probably ammo in there. And there's the uh, handcuffs. I'm telling you, man, this is a, a really nice outfit. Uh, and you guys are going to laugh what this out outfit's actually for. It's for Roscoe P. Coltrane. <laughs> Could you, you, <laughs> Yeah, it's the laugh. Uh, you know, from Dukes of Hazard. yeah, you could get this entire outfit all together. So it's like, I didn't have to buy the shirt, pants, and the belt separate. It's all like a done deal. And the good thing about, again, those boots coming with it is I didn't have to buy extra boots because, you know, they're ready to go. So, uh, and I know some of you are also doing customs using those movie uh, Kirks and using those uniforms to make the rest of the crew. So if you got a bunch of bonus uh, William Shatner's laying around like I do and you want to turn yours into uh, uh, I was gonna say turn yours into Roscoe P. Goldrain, don't do that. Turn him into TJ Hooker, way cooler. Uh, I will leave a link in the description below where you can get this entire outfit. All right. So there it is. And you know, TJ Hooker, I don't know if you guys saw that, that was a really great show. That's the first hit show William Shatner had after Star Trek. I think in the 70s, he only churned out a couple of movies like Kingdom of the Spiders. <laughs> Anybody remember that? And of course, Star Trek, the animated series. But aside from Star Trek, he had TJ Hooker, man. Bonafide hit. I think it ran about five seasons. It also starred Adrian Schmed and Heather Locklear. Uh, not to be confused with Heather Thomas. She was in The Fall Guy with Lee Majors. Bionic Man. Oh, 
that's who we need to. We need a, a six million dollar man figure. That would be awesome. But in the meantime, I got TJ Hooker. All right, y'all, here's one final look at this awesome figure created from the Star Trek II Wrath of Khan Admiral James T. Kirk into this boss looking TJ Hooker. Mm -mm. All right, guys, that is it for today. Thank you so much for checking out my video. It really means a lot. I appreciate it. And if you enjoyed this type of video, do me a favor, hit like and subscribe and leave me a comment down below. Let me know if there's something else you'd like me to uh, customize or if you, you've done some customs yourself, share those with me. I love to hear about them. Um, I do have another one waiting in the wings. So again, if I get enough likes and comments, I will do another one. I'll keep doing them as long as you guys keep watching them. And also do me a favor, hit the notification bell. That way you'll get notified the next time I do one of these videos. All right, guys. So that is it for now. Thank you so much for watching. In the meantime, me and TJ Hooker We'll catch you later.